What's up guys, welcome back to the Hypest channel on the internet. Today, you are about to watch the full length movie of the Haunted Mansion series. Now this is a four part series that I'm gonna be putting all together. And if you haven't seen any of those, this is gonna be a treat for you. So make sure you watch this video all the way to the end because there is a surprise that you probably won't expect. Now you guys are probably wondering when the next series will be released. And I'm gonna be announcing those dates on my Instagram. So this is my handle right here, hype underscore Mike. And if you're too lazy to type that out, there'll be a link in the description below. But if you're following me there, you're gonna know exactly when the next series of videos will be released. I've been editing it for a couple of days now and it's gonna be absolutely insane. So make sure to go follow me there. Now with all that being said guys, I present to you the Haunted Mansion movie. All right, dude, where are you taking me? We're obviously here, right? This is it. Okay, so again, you know, driving for hours, you haven't told me anything. What is this place? How about we step outside and I'll explain everything. Okay. Uh, oh no. This is another library. This is another library. I have been specially requested to arrive at this library because we are looking for something very, very special. We are looking for a newspaper article. I've done this before in the past. Libraries like this normally have records of local newspapers that have been published around the town and they just keep the history of whatever's going on around here. The reason why we are here is because I got a special message on Instagram from, I'm guessing, a fan. Guys, if you're not following me on Instagram, I don't know what you're doing. If you have any ideas on where I should go next or want to tell me about special places like this person did here you gotta follow me there i also post like really really cool pictures sometimes here and there so follow me there anyways let's get into the message that i received the other day so this is from a fan that goes by the name of willow and he says i don't know if you'll ever read this i am reading this but i have a job that i know only you can do and i need your help before it's too late there's this thing a spirit or demon that has been haunting my family for generations every single year during the winter months. You see, I live in a beautiful mansion. It has been with my family for a really long time. These past couple years have been not the best. Every year, when the temperatures outside start to drop, the paranormal activity starts to get worse and worse. So bad to the point where I've lost all three of my children to this spirit. For the past three years, each of my kids have disappeared in the middle of winter, never to be seen again. It's the spirit. I know it. There's something that it wants from me. I just don't know what it is. Everyone thinks I'm crazy, but I've seen things that people can never explain without seeing them for themselves. I need your help because winter's approaching quickly and things are starting to happen. And guys, he is not uh, lying about this. The trees are changing color. It is starting to get winter, so it's starting to check out so far. I just want your help so I can finally understand what it wants. I know you may not believe any of this, but if you're interested, there is a library in the town near my place with a news article on the disappearance of my kids. And this is the one. I guess. This is the library. Guys, he goes and says, Oh there, ask for the article on the Willow House. If anyone asks any questions, just say you're a good friend of Adriana Willow. If this interests you, contact me and we will arrange a time for you to stay at the mansion. You will be able to stay there for a long time or as long as you like. Thank you, Gordon. Okay. So there's the message. That's pretty intense. So I read that and I was like, it's a little too detailed to seem like he's faking it. And I talked to him a little bit and he gave me the address to this library right here. And like he said, we were looking for an article about the Willow House and if anyone asks any questions... Say we're like a friend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like I said before, guys, if you want to follow me on Instagram and send me ideas of what I should do in the future, follow me there. What do you think, Nick? Should we go inside? I think we should go inside. I'm excited to check this out. <sighs> Hopefully this article is here, guys. Maybe we'll get a little bit more details on what the hell is going on at this mansion. But for right now, let's try to find this thing. Okay, before we get into the rest of the video, I need to talk about today's video sponsor, which is The Walking Dead Survivors. This game allows you to go back into the world of The Walking Dead in very fun ways. You guys don't understand how happy I was when I saw Rick Rhymes as a playable character in the game, because if you didn't know in the show, he... 
Actually, before I spoil anything, all I gotta say is Rick Grimes doesn't really get enough screen time. That's all I gotta say. But anyways, there are also many other characters in the show that you get to play, like Glenn and Michonne. So if you like those characters, you can play them as well. Now, even though the show is sadly coming to an end, I'm happy to say that the community of The Walking Dead will still be alive and well in this game. So for example, in the game Walking Dead Survivors, clans play a huge role in the gameplay and meeting other players. Clans allow players to build massive strongholds as well as claim territories across the region. Your goal in the game is to maintain your camp while simultaneously dealing with the hordes of zombies outside your walls. These tasks can involve gathering supplies, farming for food, training new fighters, attending your community's medical needs, as well as recruiting new heroes. Now this one is super important because every character in the game has their own unique skills and attributes. Now unfortunately, during my playthrough, I didn't have enough medical aid to help this dying guy next to a tree, so unfortunately, I had to let him pass away and turn into a zombie. This game is full of hard decisions like that, so if it does sound interesting to you, make sure to check the link in the description below, as well as in my top pinned comment. I will leave a link there where you can click on it, and that will take you straight to the games page in the App Store. And if you notice right here, there's a little code, you could also scan that, that'll take you straight to the App Store as well. You could also use the code TYD Survivors, which allows you to get $20 worth of in-game rewards. So what are you guys waiting for? Click the link, download the game, and come find me in the Walking Dead Survivors. Who knows, maybe I'll even let you join my clan. It's pretty dead around here, isn't it? Yeah, oh, not never many, mind, there's oh. actually someone right there. <laughs> I was just about to say, not many people uh, going to libraries these days. Yeah, right? Like, I used to go to libraries and play Yu-Gi-Oh! Fun fact. Really? Yeah, I was one of those kids. I uh, I would always go to them, like, rent manga out and stuff, because I couldn't uh, afford to buy it myself, so... Nice. Yeah. Did you take the cards from the mangas? Uh, no, I... Pff, no, never. me neither. I would never do yeah, that. never. Who would do that? Y you have a mask, right? I think I forgot it. Do I have to go get you one? Yeah. Please. I'm All right. sorry. All right. I didn't know. You didn't tell me where right. we were going. I thought we were getting food. I was hungry. You still gotta wear a mask when you go get food, no, bro. like drive through man. Oh, you, my you, God. You, you gotta warn me, man. All right. You stay here. Okay. I'll go get you a mask. Yep. Hopefully nothing bad happens to you. Okay. All right. Bye. I'll just wait here, I guess. Bye. So we are currently at the temporary entrance. Apparently the rest of this place is closed for some reason. So we're gonna try to go inside. I'm not exactly sure if we're allowed to film, but we're gonna try to keep this as low key as possible. If they do tell us to turn it off, I might have to pull out my iPhone. Hopefully we don't have to do that. So going inside and let's find this news article. All right, we're going uh, stealth mode. Avo 6, Here we going go. dark. Oh my God, look at this. Alien? Ooh. Oh, it's not the alien. No, never mind. No, this is the OG alien. Alien took the idea from this. <laughs> from this. Guinea oh. coach. <gasps> We're gonna oh, right now. Oh, okay. oh, there we go. Alien isolation. Oh, perfect. This is why we're here, guys. We want to get onto the. What's this ship called? I don't remember. It's, oh. you know, with Ripley's uh, daughter. Yeah, whatever ship she was on, that's the <laughs> next series. Okay, guys, so um, I just talked. I just talked to the front desk and the article that we are looking for, she said we can only ask um, the other desk at the back end of the, we're gonna go there and see what's up. I'm just waiting for someone to come. Hi. Hi. Hey. Um, yeah. Uh, do you guys, uh, give out newspapers like uh, like if I'm looking for a certain article um, I'm looking for an article on the Willow House Do you guys have that? Sure, let me see sure. if I can find it I'm sorry? Are you planning on doing anything bad to this article? Oh no, it was, I'm just uh, friends with Adriana Willow Oh! So, just a family friend? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, just give me one second. I'm sorry, why? Why? What, is that important? We only have those articles in the restricted Oh, really? Restricted. Let me just quickly go grab your newspaper. Okay. Thank you. Dude. Okay, they're gonna go get the, the article. But bro, it's from the restricted area, bro. Really? I didn't even know how libraries had that. That's so weird. Like... 
Maybe that's why he like said. That we have to mention that we were friends or something? If anyone asks any questions, yeah, she's like, like, why? Why do you want this article? I'm just like, I don't know, I'm just like friends, right? And then weird, restricted dude. area. Oh, she's coming back. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Yeah, thank you. And do I have to bring this back? Okay. Okay, this is what we got, guys. Um, Father of three blames ghost for children disappearance. That's pretty heavy. Holy hell. Okay, well, um, so she gave me two. Uh, so the guy didn't mention anything about the second article, but we'll go through both of them, guys. Hopefully we're not too loud. So let's see. On December 7th, my birthday, Andrew Willow, a seven-year-old boy, disappeared in the middle of the night and has yet to be found. The disappearance was reported by the mother the following morning when she realized the boy's room was empty. Search and rescue teams have been on a lookout for days and have found no trace of the boy. Strangely enough, this isn't the first time the tragedy has struck the Willow family. In 2018, her oldest son, Brandon Willow, disappeared in the middle of the night with no trace of where he could have gone. In 2019, the night before Christmas, her second oldest son went missing as well. So far, all three disappearances have yet to be solved. However, when our journalist had a word with the Willow family to talk about their thoughts on the sudden loss of Andrew Willow, Here's what he had to say. I've been saying this for years. This mansion is haunted by something demonic. Whatever it is has something to do with all of this and I'm going to get to the bottom of it. Gordon Willow, that's the guy who messaged me. It's the same dude? He's an actor. I'm saying he's a fan. Look, he's like an old guy. Jeez. I mean, if any of you guys are like in the 90s or 80s, like <laughs> you're still cool. <laughs> Authorities haven't found any reason to suspect paranormal activity as the main cause of the disappearances and have said this is still an ongoing investigation. The Sheriff's Department mentioned earlier this week that they have no reason to suspect the Willow family. However, they are still going to be questioned as the investigation goes further. And then that's where that one cuts off. Okay, that's, uh, that's pretty crazy. Man. That's, that's pretty heavy, man. Like the guy is saying... Three of his kids have been disappearing because of this demonic spirit in the mansion. Authorities are saying that it might not be. So I don't know what to believe here, but I mean, there's there's something here. He's saying he's asking yeah. for our help to make sure nothing bad happens again. So what do you think? Should we should we even consider this? Like I think I sh we should because yeah. like you know, best case scenario is something paranormal and we could like help legitimize this thing. And yeah. Obviously, if he's making it all up and it's actually like kidnaps his uh his own children or whatever like mm. prove that it's that's like, true so it's a win-win um but why restricted section i don't know maybe that's more like because it's obvious like a, an investigation or something so uh-huh you went in like one of the doors like it literally had like a how to show like a little clip of it um, but like the door is like locked, it says no access. So there is a restricted section. I wonder what others think is there in the restricted section. I know, section. right? Like, don't go in the restricted section at 3 a.m. <laughs> Let's check out the other article we have here. What does it say? Um, it's just a smaller piece. It says turmoil within the Willow family. So that's the same family here. The famous Willow family who famously owns the Willow Mansion has unfortunately ended. As of February 3rd, Gordon and Adriana Willow have filed a divorce and will be parting ways. Ultimately, the decision was made by the now ex-wife of Gordon Willow, saying that he has officially lost his mind. Okay. What the hell? Mr. Willow has since denied all these claims and has mentioned the loss of their children has been really hard on them. A few months ago, the Willow family lost their third child to unknown causes, although Mr. Willow has said that it is due to paranormal activity. And that's it for that. So this is the newer article. I wonder why he never mentioned... I mean, I guess this person's literally claiming that he's officially lost his mind. Yeah. Oh. I'm kind of trying to be quiet some of this. Yeah, right. I don't even know what to make of this. Is this, is this guy telling the truth then? Or is he like... Like you said, he might have kidnapped his kids. Yeah, it could be both. Like it's happening again. Like, that's really, really sus. <laughs> yeah, that's pr if there's anything sus about it, um, it definitely has something to do with it. That person just went in the restricted section. I 
think he just like walked in. I don't know if he works here. <laughs> Dude, I'm scared of him. freaking come for Okay. Um, well, I think we got what we came for. Um, I'm gonna try to give this back to her and then uh, we'll try to like make a decision on what we should do. Okay, I'll just wait here. Yeah. Okay. Return the paper. I'm thinking there is some side to the story that is legitimate. This guy is saying that his kids are going missing and he's asking for our help. A little sketchy. What do you think? Should we do this? I think so, man. I think it's, again, a win-win. You know, we either prove him innocent and find something paranormal or prove him guilty and then, like, his kids get actual justice kind of deal. Do you so, think we could even... Like, what would we even find? Like, his kids are missing, right? Like, will we... Oh, maybe find the children that went that went I don't missing. Know. I'm just assuming if we don't find anything paranormal, then this guy is guilty. Okay. Well, guys, I'm gonna try to convince everyone else to come to this. We've never done a haunted mansion on the channel before, or any mansion for that matter. So hopefully, I could get a few more details on where the location of this mansion is. If everyone does decide to come on this adventure with me. With that being said, the next time you'll see us will likely be on the road towards this haunted mansion. I'll see you guys then. And good morning, everybody. Good morning, everybody. What is up, guys? My name is Hype Mike, and welcome back to the Hypest channel on the internet. Today marks the beginning of the Haunted Mansion series. As you can see right here, it is currently 8.04 in the morning. Now, thankfully, I was able to convince everybody to come on this journey for me, so all I have to do is go wake them up, pick up Jesse, and then after that, we could be on our way. Today, we have a long, long drive. That is why I'm waking up so early in the morning gotta go all the way to like northern ontario to some like small town it's insane i've also been packing a lot or not really packing just like getting rid of a lot of stuff in my room because if you guys didn't know we are currently moving we are moving to a new place yes so i've been doing a lot of packing and a lot of moving around so it's been a very very busy time so if i haven't uploaded in a long time please forgive me also if you can't tell i got a new camera so it's it's looking pretty fresh i gotta say hopefully you guys enjoy it it'll make the content much much better i find and also we might be able to capture a bit more evidence of ghosts hopefully because apparently this thing is really really good in the dark so there's gonna be a lot of spooky stuff going on now before we actually go on this adventure I want to remind you guys to go down below click on that subscribe button I'm gonna give you guys five seconds to do that because apparently 25% of you are only subscribed to the channel the other 75% of you I don't even know where you're coming from so if you do enjoy these videos you gotta press that subscribe button because these videos do follow one another so if you don't want to miss out on any of the parts of the series I'm gonna give you those five seconds right about now five four three two one there you go, now you're subscribed. Now you're not gonna miss out on any of the parts of this Haunted Mansion series. Now all I gotta do is go wake up the boys, pack up my bag, and we're gonna hit the road. So I'll see you guys there. What the hell was that? What? Dude, I don't know what the hell was that. You hit something? Okay, let's go out. Michelle, did you hit something? I don't know. I, I think hit so. something. Jesus. Get, okay, okay, let's, let's, go, let's go outside. Let's go. Dude, there is something here. What is you? Where'd it go? What, what is that? Oh, wait, what? God. Look, look. Wait. Dude, I, That's oh so my much God. blood. What, what the, the hell, hell is that? Hey, did you see it? There was something, it was like, uh, I, I couldn't get a good look at it, I just saw like a black shadow that just ran Dude, across. It's literally all over the Jeep. How Maybe a deer? That thing? A no, deer? no, no, if it was a deer, it would have been no, way it was, it was, it was up, blood. It, it kind of seemed like it was upright or something, and yeah, if it was a deer, your windshield up, would wait, be like... Up, upright? upright? Like a, like a it person? It kind of looked like it was slouching, I don't know, it was just this... Okay, wait, like, is there like a blood trail, maybe? It might have been a person. Look, look, look. There's blood anywhere else? There's blood here? here? On the floor. There's blood here, look, there's blood here. Dude, this is like... A lot, a lot of blood, though. We'll keep keep following it. Well, 
Wait. I'm obviously friends with the woods, right? Look at this! Oh, yeah, on the leaf. <gasps> Wait, what is that? Something's crying. You hear that? It's, it's like something's crying. Go check it out. What the hell is that? Yeah, do we, do we look, check it out? What did it look like? Was it a person? Did we hurt someone? I mean, it, it had to have been a person or something, right? Like, this is, this is not good. Hello? Is somebody there? Hello? There's like a tree. Oh my god. I don't like this. I don't like this. I'm going in the car. Yeah, let's, let's go into the car right now, okay? Okay, okay let's go, let's go. What the hell was that? Like, the I hell from the back? I don't know, bro. It was like loud, like really, really loud. It was so weird. Dude, I've never heard anything that loud before. Like, that close to? And, and it was like, I don't know what it was, it sounded really messed up. Literally terrifying. Well, we're, we're literally like right here, I'm pretty sure, like, oh. Let's see. Oh my. Oh, yeah, is there's that, a, it? you guys see it? Oh, yeah. It's huge. It looks very spooky off the of that. Look at this. Kind of off-roading right now. Yeah, this is, uh. Um, are you guys not a little bit concerned that, you know, the screen was like, near. not too far from here. You know, I, I feel like as soon as we get inside this house, we'll uh, be fine. We'll be fine Cause yeah. it is huge. Yeah, I mean, Holy. we have. This is this will be protecting us from whatever the heck that was from outside. That's yeah, one hundred percent. We'll be okay. So let's just park here, I guess. Yep. And uh, let's get out and see this place. Hey guys, we finally made it. The Haunted Mansion. This is absolutely insane. Look at the size of this place. It's uh, pretty Humongous. crazy. The, the window. Is the window open? No, I swear, it is open. And I swear to God, something was there standing there. Something was there? I'm not kidding. Like a, like a, the like hell? a smaller head. Maybe like a kid or something? A kid? A kid. Yeah. Are you sure that anyone, like, nobody's here for sure. Well, Maybe we're seeing one of the kids who went Dude, missing. This is like the completely wrong place. <laughs> oh my. Like some random person's house. Well, the key is apparently under the rug. Okay. So okay. if that's there, then a classic. Yeah. But that, this is the right place. <laughs> I feel like we should be a little concerned though, if that's. People look out. For yeah, I mean that's obviously pretty uh pretty creepy, but. Yeah. Assuming you're not just like seeing things. No. Oh. It was like a a black figure, and like the you see how. The drapes, they like they were moving. They were like moving a little bit. So but there I was for sure anything. something there. And the window is literally open, so I feel like there's like something I mean, it up, could be bro. Wind moving it, right? Like yeah. Who knows? Oh, you know what? Maybe, maybe. Since the window is open. Well, yeah. I am officially creeped out. So yeah. let's cool. just so get inside. Uh, oh, oh my God, are you Michelle's well? Break his ankles. Oh my God, dude, you look at what this path. Oh, you like? Oh, this oh, is a big rock. You're in the garden, oh you monkey. <laughs> no, the garden. This is the this is the entrance. This is. The, <laughs> oh wait, I'm in the garden. Oh, where? <laughs> it looks like a garden. I know, but. Oh my God. Yo, this hey. place is really big. Look at it. Oh my. Okay, we got a mat. Do we have a key? Oh, Whoa. what the? What was that? What the fuck was that? I tried opening the door and something just... Dude, I'm freaking that freaking was... out. What the hell was that? There's something <laughs> inside there. What just happened? I'm freaking terrified. Get the key. Let's just get yeah, it. Let's what just this? happened? Oh my oh okay, god. There There's a key? Jesus. Oh, I was, I was like, like, dude, the there's no the wrong house now. Oh. <laughs> okay, so this must be it, right? <laughs> What, what was that crossed? sound, dude? Like, know. do you see anything in those windows? Mm, oh, it's pretty in there. That was loud, too. That it was, was like loud. a bang. Yeah. You know what? What if it's all the kids staring through the peephole? I tried mm. opening the door. He got scared. He ran for it. Ran? Yeah. Oh, man. I don't know, man. All right, guys. Let's welcome get her open. to the haunted Willow Mansion. Um, I, uh, nice. Wait. Try it again. What is that? Free wine. Shh. Dude, us. damn ducks, bro. I literally, I thought I heard something. <laughs> I'm tripping out, man. I think okay. we're all a little... There, there we, go. we go. That sounded right. Do, do it again, do it again. Welcome to the haunted Willow Mansion. <laughs> <laughs> what is going on right now? I unlocked it, I swear to God. opening. Come on, please. What if like, this they is not the entrance? They gave you a key that didn't Okay, work. that one? What if this is just not the entrance? Maybe try a different Yeah, right? Door? A place this oh. big, like... Oh, oh. <gasps> There we go. Oh, it cracked Thank open. Okay, right. can you get it more open? Like, do that again. One more time. Third time is the charm. To the haunted Willow Mansion. <laughs> 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 oh, 
Oh, what the hell? So what? There was a chair. Uh, there, was a, there was a chair here. What? Do you think that was like trying to hold the door closed or something? Maybe this Why was is there like, a chair here? Maybe that it, was like here. Why is yeah, that the way to lock the door? It was literally the against the the door. Maybe it must have been because I, sh- I shook this fell? door. But why was it low? Why would it be like that? Dude, That's it's so dark in here. Yeah, this is so light. Spooky. Let's open her up. Oh, I can see inside. Oh. Yo, what, what does it look like? There's a staircase um, and a bunch of closed doors. Uh, problem. What? what? There's another chair, but I can't. Oh, what the hell? I can't even open it. Look, it doesn't move past this point. Oh, yeah, I can see it. Look. <laughs> Come on! What the heck? Is there another way? Can you see what's, like, walking? Hello? Yeah, there's a chair there. There's a chair, you can, yeah. Why are there chairs locking the doors? I have no idea. Maybe the ghosts are just like putting chairs here so no one like gets in. <laughs> yeah, literally. That, I mean, what if that was the case? Okay, well, how are we gonna get in? We can't get in through the doors. Um. Uh, well, this is the place the key does me? work. Unless we all just sleep here. Uh, we're this gonna... is, we're gonna be doing our paranormal investigation in the entrance mm-hmm. of the Haunted Willow Mansion. <laughs> <laughs> it's a haunted Wait, slumber. Oh, secret path? That would have been really cool. Yeah. Well, um, where are our options? Uh, we can pick the lock with a hanger. The pick the lock has oh, no lock. Oh, it's a chair, Michael. It's open. It's okay, it's not awake right now. We can it's okay, man. Let's go back to bed. It. Yeah, we can uh, smash through it. Definitely don't uh, want that theme. How about one of us tries to find a way in and then like goes around and like, moves the chair. Uh, so yeah, we can find like an open route. There has door. to be more the back door. Yeah, yeah. yeah, me and Nick, we can probably go. Right. Good luck, guys. Be safe. Don't yeah, do anything have crazy. Have fun. Don't like run off and do something stupid. Yeah. Right? I was just saying that too. Don't do anything crazy. Good. You guys are outside. We are inside. Get us in. Okay. Out in the freezing cold. Yep. Let's find a way in this freaking mansion. Bro. This. An actual path. Right. To a uh, different front door. So maybe this is the one that they wanted us to go. Hopefully. What type of house has two front doors? I don't know, but. That's terrifying. That's, holy hell, bro. And your video's copy striked. Oh. <laughs> Shoot. Not working um, either? No. Here, check that window. This looks like a... What? 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 Oh what? my god. What? Dude. You know how you heard a noise in the house when we yeah. were at the front door? The guys are right there, right at the front. Okay. I look right over here in the corner. I don't know if you could see that. There was something standing in the corner of the room, like all the way over there to the right. Really? And I swear to God, I pointed my flashlight at it. I'm like, what the f is that? And then it just like. Phew. Like okay, instantly. are you sure? Are you like absolutely I, sure? I got goosebumps from this shit, man. Okay. I swear to God, I literally... S- that thing that Jesse described, literally right above us. Up here? Whatever he saw, I think I saw that. Okay, let's just proceed with extreme caution from now on. Maybe let's try to not make as much noise as we try to enter the house. Okay, yeah. What the hell? There's no way. Oh, please. Please, please. <sighs> they have a pool and it's locked. Dude, we need to go swimming in here. This is what we do. Okay, just listen. We grab a stone from over there. Mm-hmm. We'll break the window. And then we're just going to go swimming for like a few hours and not tell anyone. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. And okay. I'll just cut this clip out of the video completely. And yeah, absolutely. Okay. Well, the next scene will have wet hair. People will be like, what the hell? <laughs> we'll tell them it was raining. Yeah, it is raining. Yeah, Look. So it's like... Storm's coming in. The storm's coming in, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright, cut the camera, cut the Seriously, dude, a pool? Yeah, let's... That's locked. I'm assuming all these would be locked. Right? I'm thinking we're gonna have to maybe, like, find, like, a window or something. All of them locked.
Oh, dude. No, please. Oh, so close. Pretend I never opened that. All right, let's continue, I guess. Dude, this place is massive. Huge. Yeah, it's a. Uh, it's pretty friggin' massive, man. Okay, what do we got? We got a door here. Door there. Door there. Got a lot of doors, guys. So I don't want to show you every door that we try to open. So we're just gonna cut to the next open door. Hopefully, we find a way in. Like right there. I don't know if you could see that. Yeah. Like right in that corner, there was something standing. It was like higher. It was taller than that painting. I don't know if you see the painting in the corner. The painting, like a. There's like a painting all the way. Oh in the corner. yeah. It almost. I don't know, Jesse was saying there was a kid, but it was literally taller than that. Taller than that? Well, I mean, that's not a kid, right? I don't know. Anyways, guys, none of the doors work. We've tried everything. We've tried that one. We've tried all these windows, but we are not out of solutions yet. If we look right above us, there's an open window right there. Right here. And also a balcony right there with a door. So me and Nick are thinking, you know, we do have the right to be in here. True. From the owner, so. We're going to break in. What? No, we were just gonna jump like really high and like go through the the window or the door, you know? Yeah. Yeah. We're going to break our muscles trying to get up there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm just gonna move this. Yeah, we have a picnic table to work with here. Just slide it up. Oh. Oh. There we go. Direct access. I'll go first, I guess. Yep. Oh. Nice. There you go. That wasn't so bad. Should I test the door before you come up, or do you uh, want to? Yeah, please. Any luck? She's open here. Give me the camera. Oh, here. Careful. Hey guys, just doing some technical work over here. All right, Nick, just pull yourself up and lean your butt cheeks on that. Subscribe to this man for freaking <laughs> going through this with me. Ooh. Dude, the freaking wet grip. I know. Not fun. Watch this whole balcony just like. <laughs> ah! <laughs> like a bunch of Home Alone traps on like the top <laughs> floor here. Let me. Uh... So this is it. Here, we made it to the master bedroom. We're inside now, we should be pretty cautious. Hello? She was off, cause I'm being a Oh my God, look at this room, dude. An entire fireplace? It's pretty insane in here. what to expect on the other side, but here we go. What was that? I don't know. Dude, this place is freaking creepy, man. Sounds like something was in the washroom. Okay, let's... Let's see anything. Hello? There's the chair down there. Oh my, what? what the hell is that? What, what? Stick the camera out there. What the hell is that? Is that, that kind of looks, that's like, like a thing, like flesh or something, right? Yeah. It's I not can. just blood, but it's covered in blood. And there's blood literally right here as if like something like climbed. 
Okay, dude. I'm kind of freaked out. Oh, dude. Bro. Something is here. Hello? Guys, is that you? Should we go get them or should we go see what the uh, f it is? I mean, we're here to investigate, right? I feel like we should go see. Like, anytime we hear something, this we might not hear anything for the rest of the night, right? Let's just go see. Dude, look how long this hallway is. I don't even know where that noise came from. It could be any one of these rooms. Hello? Is anyone that go by the name of Willow still live here? It's like... Close this. Oh, he's broken. It's huge. It's larger than my hand, and I have huge hands. Okay, we're just gonna close this. So we don't have any, like, wind coming in and potentially, like, spooking us. But, yeah, you're right. It is, like, if I, like, put my hand, like, here. That's massive. And that kind that might not even be like the whole thing too, right? So Jesse saw something here, yeah. right? He saw something here. This was moving. I saw something downstairs. So we could be like dealing with like a bunch of like different, like multiple ghosts here for sure. But I don't know. Okay, ghosts, do they do that? I don't know. I've never seen, like, this type of imprint from any, like, ghosts, right? I don't know, but let's try to... Let's get the others and, like, tell them what the hell we are looking at and yeah. show them this. Okay. That was not. Something was knocking from inside the house. I literally, I'm already like freaking out. I don't even know if I want to do this anymore. Right? Hello? Freaking terrifying. Hello? The chair's still there, so they're still outside. Let's see. Okay, let's just go get the men. This is the, the place, right? Yep. That's it. Guys? And the door is open? Guys? Hey, yo, quit playing. Guys? Some messed up shit just happened inside. What the hell? What is that? Something's moving. Close the doors. Okay, whatever is going on out there, I don't want anything to do with it. Yeah, I think we need to stay inside when we find the others. You guys in here? Hello?
What was that? I don't know. It sounded kind of far away. Like someone is screaming to me. Hello? Somebody out here? Michelle? Nick? I don't think there's one of them. Right? Um, Guys? I don't know, man. It's kind of weird. What should we do? Should we well, he said he said to stay, but like, I feel like we should be kind of going in by now. Are you right? right? Like, a, yeah, I, we might. Yeah. Wait. Did you hear that? That was way closer. Okay, come, come in, come in, come in, come in. What was that? I, I have no clue. Well, no, dude, you want to stay in here while that thing's out here? I don't know. Well, so do you want to go? They're not back yet. Yeah, like, what if we leave and, and then they come back and we're gone? Okay, then but what, do we do? what if this thing comes at us and we're locked in this tiny little room? Okay. No, I think we should try to find a way in. Okay, another This place is so big, there has to be another door somewhere. There, yeah, exactly. Okay, we have to be careful. It's like really close to you. Oh my god. Okay, okay. This is huge. Oh my goodness. Dude, there's like doors everywhere. There's, there's One of these has to be open, right? Okay. No. Be careful, be careful. The back door goes so far back, you literally can't see anything. Front door and trying to lock it so yes, that yeah. they, yes. they go back. Oh, I miss somebody. Hello? Let's go see them. Guys? What the fuck? Oh, oh, what the? It's Guys, locked. come. Oh, yeah, look, there's like a chain link at the top. Guys, I literally hear you. Wait. Are you, is there somebody out there, like a little kid? Hello? Okay, you know what? Let's just try to find a different exit. I don't know. Just Anything? Check that door. Anything? No. This place is huge. Yeah, it's rooms. Oh, there's stairs. Here. Guys, come on! Oh, oh my god! What the hell's the matter with you guys? We heard you coming upstairs and we're like, holy crap. You guys heard the same thing? So you heard the thing in the you kitchen, right? You guys were hearing it too? In the kitchen? In the kitchen, I didn't hear it. Kitchen, anything. no, we heard some stuff upstairs. Well, it, I saw, I don't, know if, I don't know if it was a kitchen, but there Wait, was like a how counter. How did you guys get inside? What? How did oh, you get inside? There was like a room downstairs. Uh, it was already door. unlocked. You guys yeah. didn't leave a door open? We just came in through an open door in the back. Yeah. No, we checked all the doors in the back. They were all the doors um, like locked. Like, None of the doors work. We've tried everything, we've tried that one, we've tried all these windows. If the door was physically open. It was already a little bit open. open. I thought you guys might have gone through there. But the only reason why we even looked for another way in is because we heard a bunch of screams. Outside? Yes. Outside. yes. Yeah, that's what, yeah, that's what we heard. No, but I'm talking no, about, after you left. like, in the house. You guys didn't hear the ones in the... No. Something was in, like, I don't know, I don't know if it's the kitchen, but there was, like, a cabinet that... No, we kind of just came from there. We didn't, uh... What? We, like, we just heard, like, a few minutes ago. Hmm. It literally sounded like you guys. I, thought you I mean, it could have been us, rolling. but like, no, we, we didn't called hear out you. for you. We, you would have heard us. We, we, oh. we called out for you guys. Yeah, multiple times, yeah. Like, you would have heard it if it was you. I don't know. We we came from the master bedroom. We literally had to physically climb yeah, the house, really? like, really? physically climb a balcony. And then we heard something moving upstairs. And there, were, remember that washroom? Oh my god, Jesse. We're gonna go up and show you after. Yeah. There's an actual like bloody handprint in the what? room. You the the thing that you saw in the window. You're lying. There's a bloody handprint. So there's something there. there and um around here, there's like another door. I looked through the window, and I swear to God, next to you guys, you guys were chilling in the main room. Next to you guys, there was a thing 
standing in the corner of the room. I point my flashlight at it, boom, just disappears. What? Yeah. Like while, like it moved. Like I saw something, I point my flashlight at it, and the moment I see it, it like went to the side. Huh. I think it might have been the same thing that you saw in the washroom, but I don't know. In the actual, wow. Okay, so what do we do now? Are we 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 can just go in, like? Yeah, we could go explore the house. Unlocked? We're we're now inside. Yeah. We're we're safe from whatever the heck's out there. We're gonna go inside. Let's check out the whole house. It's a big place, guys. So. We should stay together. I know it's big, but we yeah. should do like yep. I don't wanna. I think that's probably a good idea. I told you guys one thing. I said, don't run off and do something stupid. Yeah, have fun. Crazy. Have fun. Don't like. Run off and do something stupid. Yeah. Yeah. Immediately runs off and does something stupid. Well, you guys were so you, you, if, you, if you heard what we heard, you would understand. Something is out there and it was getting closer. Yeah. Like we had to go. There's I mean, we kind of heard, we tried to find you. We were like, oh, we moved the chair. We're like, where are you guys? And then we started hearing something in the woods. It was starting to like yeah. move around. So um, So like we kind of like ran in and hopefully like pray that you guys like managed to come in somehow. Yeah. Hmm. But now we're here. We're all together. So how about we like look around? Yeah. I mean, look at. Where we are right now. Yeah, this, this is like the creepiest. It's like a place. garage, right? It's yeah. A garage, and then there's just like this, like setup. Like, Chill spot. It's the hang out in the dark. It's the poker room, baby. The poker room, yeah. Yeah. All right. Who's ready to actually see the mansion now? It's now time. Inside. Welcome to the haunted Willow Mansion. Whoa. Jesus. Yo, a half door. That's for you. What is that? It's for me. I don't know what this is for. Must have been, been a reason back in the day. Oh, what is this used for? Fireplace. You go through there. No, if I get a portal into another dimension, I wouldn't do it. <laughs> Whoa. Oh! <laughs> you just scared all of yeah, the viewers. Like that at all. Yeah, you got us. You got me too. Wow, nice place. Let's take off the shoes. We don't want to ruin it, right? That's, That's exactly what, what we said. <laughs> okay, so it is a kitchen. Yeah, dude, look, look. Come see this. Oh my god. It is. Look, guys, it's locked. I knew it. Looking through here, and I could see this, whatever this was. Okay. But I, nothing was there, and you guys weren't answering. We heard stuff. We, we heard, heard movement stuff. like yeah. in this area, and it wasn't. Yeah. You guys weren't ever here. It definitely sounded like. I mean, we walked by here, but, but you if you were us. here, yeah. like you I would have obviously. Our faces were like right in this back. Here, open this up. So creepy. Okay. Well, hmm. do we go? What's next? Um, I mean, there is this room over here that I wanted to check out. The one that I saw the, the thing in? Whoa, what is this place? Oh my god, wow. It's like actually huge. These like it's a big dinner party. Yeah, yeah, there's a lot of really scary paintings in this place. Look at this! Oh my god. Look how so old these are. Is that a unicorn? Oh. Yeah. Oh, that's a unicorn. What is that? It's underneath me. What? It's like a some kind of maybe like generator? Yeah, furnace or something? That's... Hmm. Why is it just turning on now? Right? That's so weird. Technically we were just under here. Very weird. You didn't hear this when you were downstairs? No. 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 The thing that I saw was probably like this tall. What? Yeah. And so I saw it from... I don't know if you can see it. That. Yeah, we were go. all the way over there. Did hmm. Nick see it? Yeah. Did you no, see it? I was uh, looking somewhere else. So it was standing here, flashlight points at it, boom. So definitely not what I saw, because... That's what I was saying, I'm like, that me and Jesse couldn't have seen the same thing, because the thing that was like eight feet tall. Unless it was like kneeling in the bedroom? Mm, kind of like trying to hide? Oh, wait till I show you the handprint and maybe that'll make sense. We should probably move this chair. Probably a good idea. Yeah, so that's a fire hazard. And... Close the door, yeah. maybe? Yeah. Wait, Nick. Yeah. We moved that chair. Yeah, we ran out and what? we came back in and we never put it back. We came literally, we, we moved it, we went outside, we heard something and we ran back in. Like we weren't there? Yeah, but we never put it back. Okay, you just told us that in the garage. So why did I just move another chair? Um, you put it back and just forget? I don't think I so, don't no. I would never just like put a chair back against the door like that. Uh, okay. Yeah. Dude, that, that's... I don't yeah. even know how to explain that. How do you explain that, Nick? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, you know what? I, I get it. It's one of those... It's on wheels. Yeah. It's it magnets. Automatically. Yeah, magnets. No, it doesn't. No. Oh, that's what the generator thing is. Uh, it like yeah. moves all it the It just moves everything back to where the original <laughs> position was when we got 
Here. Is that three clocks? No, no those three are dishes. Plates. Oh my god. Cut that. We're gonna cut that now. <laughs> <laughs> So initially, oh my god! Yeah, no, this place is huge. Initially, we came through this door here. This is crazy. The Wait, you came alone, through this? Like super yeah, crazy. yeah, we came within through this uh, this room. Oh my god! Our shoes are even still here. What through the? this door, we climbed up. What do you mean you climbed up? There's no I stairs. Swear. What? You guys are nuts. Jesus. I told you guys not to do anything crazy. Jesus. This is a scale very dimension high. walls. No, yeah, it was perfectly safe. Professional climber. Uh, I've done this for many years. Yeah. Breaking yeah. my muscles. Yeah, absolutely. Abs I totally believe you. 100% not. I don't believe it at all. Look, it has a fireplace and everything. This is like the room, dude. This is the room. This, this is the room. room. Wow. Who is this handsome man? Let's see. That's me. That's yeah. Mr. Willow? Maybe? Yeah, maybe. It's possible. But why would his photo be in the small bedroom? Right? Not even the mess. Wait. Where's that? I was gonna say, where's that blood? Just follow me. Okay. But I did hear something moving in here. Huh. That's a pink tub. This place is crazy. Is there anything here? The first thing I notice? Heated tiles. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah. baby. <laughs> this is some nice stuff right what here. Oh, I can feel it. What the yeah. Wow. Warm. I can feel it as well. That is lovely. Maybe that's what I heard. I thought maybe somebody was just standing around. That's standing. what that sound was. The yeah. heated floors were going on. Yeah. Don't mind me. You guys continue your investigation. Wait. I'm going to be right here. No, 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 okay, no, cold water. No, I don't do it. Do it, Jesse. <laughs> do it. Look at this random sink. This is so weird. It's like I have to be yeah, a baby your hands. to... Just kidding. Is that what you have to wash your butt with? I'm pretty sure, yeah. Don't do it! Don't! Why you are you gonna shoot him? He's gonna in the face! Ah, <laughs> doo doo water! Ew! <laughs> We're adults. <laughs> yeah. Uh, there's a light in the shower. That's when you know your shower is on a different level. It's got. Like a little. Like why? I just. Wow. Oh, no. <laughs> Did you just break it? <laughs> no. <laughs> Help me, Michelle. You're not tall enough. Fuck okay. me. What just happened? Oh, yeah. it's this thing. Yeah, you have to just put it back in. Yeah. I hope we just leave that. Yeah, we're gonna pretend this never happened. This never happened. There's a light in here. Yeah, very cool light. Yeah, I like the light. Let's get out of here. <laughs> oh my god! It's an ugly guy. I knew it. I knew ugly people lived here. Oh, oh. It was supposed to be a double whammy, but it didn't work. <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> I didn't. Nice <laughs> joke, Shira. <laughs> Good joke. Yeah. Possible. All right, look at this. Oh. Wait, what? Mm hmm. What the hell? Found this earlier. And Wait, this is not where you guys came in on the balcony. Here, and check outside. Look, oh, what the look down. All the way on, like, the second, like, roof. That was. You might want this. Don't, f don't fall, bro. Do you see it? Oh, yeah. What? Is that. Is that what we. I don't know what that is. Is that what. It's. We it it? kind of looks like it. Yeah, it looks really similar to like the. It's like a piece thing. of skin, but like, I don't know. It, I don't know. That's weird. And there's also the blood here, so kind of, I don't know. Mike, do you want to see it? I don't. I'm not. Okay, gonna but see I I'm interested. Does this look like it came? I don't know. I can't tell. It literally, out. it's too like low for me to like even like see it. What am I looking at? Uh, you'll see it when you see it. Oh, what the. Fuck? Mm hmm. Yeah. Like, Ew. It's like that thing. Thing that we saw in the jeep, the, like piece of skin. It's like, it's like a piece flesh of like, with, like flesh hair. Why would that be here? Blood. I don't know. We Another know. one. Uh, I have a bad feeling about this whole like. Place. I'm gonna close this. All right, now Jesse, follow me. We're gonna go down in the depths of the hallway. This is the, the we got real bedrooms. scary one. This is facing the backyard, or it's the one that faces the front. Yo yo yo. yo. All of you gotta go see that. Oh yeah. my god. Oh my god. Oh. Is this the spot? Is this is this wait, where wait, you wait. saw that? Was the that, window open? The window was open. I closed it. Wait, this is the room where Jesse saw the kid? This is yeah, this is the room. Right now. We saw the freaking handprint. We heard mm. one of those yells outside. It was what? nuts. I yeah. that's Terrible. so messed like, up. Like truly, truly terrifying. Is it weird to like associate what we hit with a potential kid from this house? Cause like what are the chances that there's blood here too? It was That's pretty close. Hand, we though. hit the 
Yeah. That's what in here? Put your hand. Put uh, your hand close to it. The it hand is pretty be, big because this could be like a dragged, mm. right? And they see the palm. Like if I if I had a bloody palm, it would be this wide. This is like small. But if it was dragged, the thumb would also be. Oh, okay. It kind no, of is. Yeah, it kind of looks like that. It looks like it was like he was like this. Like maybe, you know, maybe he was like like this in a hurry, kind of like and looking. Then saw us. And then you like literally see the jeep right there. That's what I'm saying. Um, what if whatever we hit outside was fleeing Here. from something in this house, and we ended up just mm. because we hit it and we heard something, and then we heard another thing, right? So we heard two separate things. Yeah. Yeah. What creepy? Whatever's going on in this house, uh, I'm not liking it so far. Yeah. Yeah. Me either. Do you touch it? Like, like it. is it fresh blood or uh, is it dry? It, it looks kind of dried-ish. Yeah. I don't know what. If it was like fresh, it would have been like liquidy, right? Yeah. So I don't know why it looks like that. They all have like cribs. Every single like not. Yeah. How many like, babies were in this house? Maybe the cribs are like the cribs of the kids that like disappeared. Maybe. Awesome. How old were they? Because I feel like... One of them apparently was really young, and then the other two were kind of mm. like approaching their teens. Get out of the closet. <laughs> no, I want to stay in here. Look, I found what could possibly be haunting this entire house. What the... Something's here. It's like right downstairs. Is it the front door? Someone has the flashlight. Are you gonna go see what it was? I don't want to go see that. I no, don't. No, no, no. no. I, we stay here. No, we're not going out there. Yeah, that shit sounded like it shook the entire Yeah, no, we're not going. Space. We're going to wait it out. How did it do that? I don't know. Look, Guys, whatever did that shook? the entire house. Like, it literally, I felt the knock. And then nothing, like literally nothing. We stay here. Just yeah, sit chill and wait until maybe we hear something pass. Oh, we're, we're staying here. Like, what, what could it have been? Like, is that paranormal? Like, I've never I felt anything know. like that. try to stay in this room for a couple more minutes no idea what that could have been if you guys have any ideas comment down below but we're gonna sit here for and I'll catch you guys in a little bit Hear that? Yeah, 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 yeah. Something just closed. Did you see what that was, Char? No. Was it the door? Which Hello? One? There's so many. I know. Wait, bro, I have chills. Wasn't this open? I don't know. I, oh, I truly don't like, remember, dude. I I'm pretty sure this was open. I think it was. You walked by it. I, I was like, Jesse's brave, and I was like looking through the. Wait, what? Do you, can we should like look at that later and, and see yeah, if this is open. Is there anyone here with us? That was me. That was me. That was oh me. I, I, I was like either I did that or there's a ghost right behind me. I'm so sorry. That was me. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. <sighs> My fucking heart, man. What the fuck? What? Did you open the door? Yes. Oh my you Oh my god, we're getting cake! Okay. Oh, we need we need like some coffee or something, like holy hell. There's the I way that your body was positioned, fun. I couldn't even tell something had that was weird. I hate these things, that man. Was funny. 
Yeah, I think we're just like there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That was weird. We'll keep an eye out on that door. Uh huh. Paranormal hotspot, maybe. Potentially. Well, good news. The chair has stayed the same. Okay. Anything like the doors aren't open. that fall fell open. Fell over maybe something like. No. no, I don't think anything in this house could fall over and shake the whole house. Right, unless it's something huge like the fridge or something. But I doubt that. Man, I'm just gonna check the front. Okay. Mm -hmm. Any like marks on the doors or anything that could have like? Not that I could see. Okay. I don't know. We'll keep looking around, try to find the source of whatever that was. Let's just keep looking around. Alright guys, so we just finished exploring the entire house. We know every single room and every paranormal hotspot that we want to check out. So what we're going to do, because this place is so big, we're going to split up into two teams. Me and Nick are going to be on one team and we're going to try to do the upstairs while the others are going to try starting in the basement and make their way to the main floor. And that's what we're going to do too. Once we do the top floor, we're going to move on to the main floor and check out some of these other rooms that haven't been explored yet. So hopefully with having two teams, we'll be able to capture much more paranormal evidence and try to get a lot more answers on why this place is so haunted during the winter. So with that being said, I'll see you guys upstairs. So we are currently in the master bedroom, about to do the first seance of the night. What should we, what should we start with? We don't really have much to go off. We only know that kids have disappeared and the people that own this place are known as the Willow family. So I guess, Maybe you just start by asking if there's anyone from the Willow family here. Yeah, that's probably the best bets. Yeah. Are there any spirits here that go by the name of Willow that like to make themselves known? Are there any other spirits here, not by the name of Willow. Is there any spirits here that are possibly a little shy? You know, you guys were making all kinds of noise earlier. Now we're actually trying to talk and figure things out. Nobody's saying anything. Are you guys here? That was really not like a seancey that question. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe that's why they're not very a very casual. I'm talking to them like we've been friends yeah, for a while. Yo, what is up? We are back in the haunted house today. What up, Low Gang? Low Gang. Ha. So we've been assigned with doing a seance in a the few seances. A few actually. seances in the room that we actually entered, as you guys can see right there. Yeah. Um, Apparently that door was left open by a ghost. So I would say I'm feeling pretty freaked out to answer your question because we're in the uh, a room that is probably haunted. Yep. Definitely see that something has been laying in the bed and it was definitely not you. Not me. I was not taking a nap here. Nope. Because nope. we are focused on the task at hand, which is a seance. Yes. Exactly. We're working. We're okay. working. So um, you want to do the first question? Yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay. If there's anything in here with us, please make yourself known. If the kid that Jester saw in the window is here with us, the spirit, uh, make yourself known. Oh, we should go into like the yeah, yeah. playroom where the kids might have played and we should ask yeah, that question like that. Oh, yeah, yeah. Maybe. If that was you earlier who closed that door or made that banging noise, can you give us a sign that you are still here with us? What was that? It sounded like... That was came from outside. It's like a firework or something? It sounded like a... Either a firework or like someone like shot something. Yeah, a little too close for. Oh. Oh my god. There's a lot of this. Huh? 
is that yelling at? What the hell is going on? That was weird. It was like a bunch of gunshots, and then we yeah. heard that thing. It didn't seem as close this time. It seemed like pretty far. Okay. I don't yeah. think anything is wanting to talk to us in this room. So maybe, how about we check that room where the door closed? Okay. I think that'll be a good spot. Does anybody want to play with us? Okay. Um, okay. Uh, Any more specific, like pool? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. If there's any spirits here, who are interested in playing, would you like to play a game of pool or play with the balls? Maybe move a ball if you want to play? There's nothing. I don't know if there's anything in here. Well, you, you try one, you try one. Okay. <clears throat> Maybe do the ping pong, do something. With the ping -pong. If any entity in here wants to lose at some ping pong. What? Did you touch that? Um, <clears throat> maybe we should keep around. Did you hear that? Who, whoever's here with us, please make yourself known. What the hell? Okay. Yeah. Yo. Shh. It's not like a footstep. Um, Yo. Let's just let's do one more at this yeah. ping pong table, yeah. and then we'll try something. Okay, if I sit here. There's a chair there for you. Okay. So, I heard you close the door earlier. Would you like to open the door for us? Maybe give us a knock or some sort? Any kind of sign that someone's here with us? Other than me and my friend Nick here? We are pretty friendly. And we just want to talk. That's like really weird. Mm -hmm, like pure silence. Like we've even been hearing noises on and off, like off camera, but yeah. there's just nothing right now. Is there a reason why the spirits in this house are not being as vocal? Can you tell us why? Are you scared? Was like a. Do you think that was a response to what I said? Could be. You asked if they were afraid. What are you afraid of? Is there something in this house that you don't want to encounter? Something outside, maybe? Are you trying to prevent things from coming into this house? Is that why the chairs were up against the door? This is weird, dude. I have like a really, really, really not good feeling about this. So you're saying that someone is in here with us? No, they seem uh, really... What's that word? Anxious? Anxious, stressed? S like, uh, nervous. Nervous. That's the word. We're gonna ask you one more question, okay? So, if you were the one who closed this door, can you give us one more sign? I heard a 
voice. You think so? Like in the corner of the room. I, f I heard something, but it wasn't like... I don't know. I couldn't make it out. It was super, super faint. It was very, very faint. I don't think the camera's going to be able to pick that up. It kind but of sounded like... Like, you know when you're outside and there's just, like, wind? Mm-hmm. But... Like, what would have made that noise? Yeah, the window is closed, so there's no, there's no wind coming in here. It's been dead quiet this entire time. What the f*** was that? What? Did you not hear that? That, like, little whistle? Yeah, it came from that corner. Dude, can we just go back? <laughs> can we actually go back? We're gonna leave this room now, okay? So if you want to follow us to the next room, you're oh welcome. Oh my god. Dude, is there anything out here? Well, you said like, you saw a kid upstairs, right? Yeah. Okay, well, when we were walking around um, in the back, I saw that there was a swing set. <gasps> a swing set? Yeah. That's yeah. creepy. And, and our question that got the most attention was, do you want to play? Okay. True, so, true. We should go to the swing set. Maybe. Oh. Out there. And also, maybe. How the hell? Dude, there's literally four doors here. Okay. So that's... I'm not even kidding. That's it, right? Right here. Okay, there we go. Yo, it's so dark out here. Yeah. Wait, listen. You hear that? I don't hear anything. It's like silent. silent. Oh! It's so faint. It's kind of far. It's coming from like. Is there like a road there? Maybe? I don't know. I can't really see anything. Here, let me turn up the light. Oh, maybe? Maybe like outside the house is haunted as well. Like maybe this, this, this is... set is like some sort of haunted area where the kid like play. Yeah, maybe. Communicate with them. Yeah, I guess we could, you know what? If the questions aren't working inside, maybe outside? Yeah. yeah. Jesus, this is so I, creepy. It's just so, it's just so dark, there's no lights from anywhere. Look how massive the house is from here. Jesus. That's crazy. It's pretty, it's, I've never seen it from this side. Yeah, I know. So okay, so here's the swing set. For sure there was kids that used this. Oh my God. Oh, shh. Sh It got really loud. Okay, let's, let's, this do, a good, let's do a quick. Yeah, we should, we should hurry up. Um, okay, go ask, ask your question. If there is a kid here, do you want to play with us? Is there any kids here with us? Make yourself known. Yo. What was that? No. What was that? Was that a gunshot? What's going on? Where, where did, no, no, it that, that came from over there, I think. The owner of the house, Mr. Willow, has asked me to help him understand why you are doing these things. If you could just give us a sign that you were here so that we could talk to you and understand why the kids went missing, or why people are hearing weird sounds during winter. Last chance, can you just give us a sign that you're here? Alert. Emergency alert. Ontario Provincial Police has issued an emergency alert for the Kenora area. There is a large unidentifiable, unidentified animal roaming the woods. It is described as a seven foot bipedal mammal similar to a gorilla. We ask everyone to remain inside. If observed, call 911. What the hell? What? Are you kidding me? The Ontario Provincial Police has a- Look at this! That's crazy! Oh my god. 
Do you think? What we hit? There's no way. Dude, it was, on, no two, way. It was on two legs. It said it's bipedal. Bro, I'm literally getting like unidentified animal. Like it has to the be provincial police is saying stay inside because they don't know what the hell this thing is. Bro. And the yelling outside, the constant yelling. Wait. There was there's the thing we hit and then there was something else. I don't know, but like this is we can't go back outside. No, we need to we, we need to warn the others. We need to warn the others. Siren's getting louder? Really? Unless we get closer to the get down, get down! Get down. Let's go. What? What the hell's going on? Can you see you? I'm gonna freaking out left. Wait, no, no, wait, wait, keep moving. Come on, okay. Bro, something growled, literally right by us. I don't even know how to explain I might, this. I might have something to explain this. What? What? I read this. Emergency alert. The Ontario Provincial Police has issued an emergency area in the Kenora, yeah, that's where we are. There's a large unidentified animal roaming the woods. Is that what they were shooting at? It is the, yo, it is described as a large seven foot bipedal mammal, similar to a gorilla. What? Is that what we hit? We asked everyone to stay inside until further notice. Wait, that's what we heard out there. We heard, bro, we heard gunshots. There was Police sirens. sirens. There, it's been going on, bro. We heard gunshots too. Yeah, we, we thought out, we heard nothing. gunshots as well. But we didn't hear any police sirens. You're saying they're outside right now? They were well, so loud. It, it the, kinda, the, if, it's the closer in. We were in the forest. And like we heard a giant like scream. And, and then we heard gunshots. So we're like, okay, let's get the hell out of here. Do you think it's this? It has to be. It has hell? to be. I've Dude. never heard a growl like that before once in my life. Maybe that's what we hit. That's what he was saying. Yeah. It could be. But why were there two of them? What do you mean? There was the one we hit. The and then there was that we, sound, right? This is the actual yell that came from behind us, which wasn't oh. the thing that we hit. Okay, maybe. There could be more than one. We don't even know what it is. Also, seven foot tall, like, gorilla climbing through that window? Unlikely. You guys see it? No, no, we couldn't no, get it. We definitely, heard it. Definitely it was heard so it. loud. Okay, how about make sure all the doors are locked. Hopefully, if if this goes on for a little longer, cops will stop it. You said gunshots, right? So maybe yeah. in like sirens, like, the police are like are here, right? Yeah, they, they could figure this out. Yeah, right? hopefully they're able to take care of whatever is going on. But what if it's like it has nothing to do with this house? Like it's just like a completely. I don't think it does. I think it's literally just like a. Like an animal, it has to be like an animal, like a weird coincidence. There's just an animal that's roaming outside, but like, why would they they describe it as a gorilla? Like, what? Yes. What could that even be? I don't know. I think we should go around, like, locking the doors, make sure we're secure in here. Yeah, it's a good idea. Okay, let's do that. All right, guys. So we are here in the I don't even know what to call this place. The third dining, dining room. room. Third dining room. Yeah. Tried to do seances alone with split teams and we didn't really capture anything. I don't know, you guys didn't even mention anything crazy. Uh, a pool ball moved. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. It um, did, but we couldn't capture anything else. Yeah. Like we went through. It was a lot of nothing. Nothing. But nothing. a pool ball moved and we asked about uh, okay. if there are any kids are here that want to play. Cause mm -hmm. we know the kids. And I don't even so. know if I even got it on camera. I tried to, but it was like, we were kind of far, so. We heard it. If we didn't see it, we definitely heard it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, there was one thing that we heard, Nick. Uh, it was, oh, are you hiding from anything? Um, That's like from in here. Okay. Didn't answer. And then I said something. I said outside, and immediately I heard yeah. something. Yeah, what'd you hear? Just like a knock. Yeah. Okay. So okay. it could be anything, but like... Yeah, there's... Maybe like... So we also got like a l very minimal response, but it's yeah. something. You guys are probably wondering what this is. We have headset and a spirit box. We've used this in the past before. You guys don't know what this is. It basically goes through any radio station, just any radio frequency that's passing by, and it just spews out random words that are generated by ghosts that are around here. So I'm gonna put these on while the rest of the guys are gonna talk, 
and I'm not going to hear anything they're saying. I've seen other paranormal investigators do this, and it seems like it works. Hey, who wants to start us off? What's his name again? Willow. Willow? Yeah. Mr. Willow? Mr. Willow. Uh, <laughs> no, he's still alive. Any of the kids. Any of the kids. Uh, well, I don't know their names either. Un other unnamed kids. Little Timmy. Okay. If any of the kids are around and can hear us, please say hello. Okay, I will, I'll try one. Um, if there's any spirits here, kids, adults, just any spirit at all, on this property, can you please give us a sign, a knock, touch my hair, maybe anything? If any of the kids here are hiding from something, can you tell us what you're hiding from? No. Did you guys hear that? Why did you say that? Is that what it said? Is he repeating what it said? Is he? Say, say another one, another one. Um, he said no, right? Yeah. Why can't you tell us what you're hiding from? Is that just like random, maybe? Can I try one more? Yeah, do one. If there are any spirits here, are you afraid? Yes. Is he? Like, this is. Yes. He's saying yes, right? Does anybody have any. Like, I have one, I have one. Do we have any reason to be afraid? Okay. That's a good what? what? Did you not. Look outside, look outside, look outside. What? Give me this guy. Look outside. I swear I just saw like eyes. Eyes. Eyes? Let's see out there. There's nothing here. Yeah, is this is like here. what towards the Jeep? Yeah, no, there's no chance, dude. Maybe you saw the reflection of like the camera or like a glisten off a leaf? Yeah, is there anything out there? No, it was like two eyes. like things. Like two eyes. big like light like things. Like You didn't like, see like a head? Or like, like um you know when you see like an animal's like okay, yeah. oh, when the their eyes glow? Okay. Oh, yeah. so they yeah. have the flash on. Well, I don't know. I didn't see anything, and I was kind of looking, so... Cat eyes! Maybe, but it, it wasn't here. It was, like, over there. Like, far. Okay, that's weird, bro. Yeah, you like were doing some weird. really weird things, too, though. Like, what? I said... What was it? Yes? Uh, or no, no one yes? That's yeah. all I got. Literally, that's it. I didn't hear anything else. That was from us asking them stuff. Yes. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Did they? It was like a good response. I think so. Yeah. I asked them if they were uh, afraid. Afraid, and they said no. So what are we saying? Do we continue here, or? I think we go to the next room. Or next yeah, room. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We'll go to the the dining room. Dude, there's nothing else. Let's just get this over with. Come on. No, I'm telling you, man. There's. Okay. We'll just get this over with. Okay. We need some answers. This one, and hopefully, we get some answers. If there are any spirits here, what the hell? Whoa, what is there? Is there? Is there? What? what? I just saw them. I saw them. Come, come, come! The, the eyes, the eyes! I just saw them. I just saw them. I promise. It was right here, right? Literally right here. I was like, literally like right behind that no, bush. Look, right behind that that's bush. That's impossible. I promise you. No, no. Look, look how high we are. Yeah, we're pretty high up. It, for you to see it, it would have been. Dude, I like, saw it. I'm telling you, I saw it. Ten feet tall. Then it's that freaking tall, man. I, I saw it. It's really up there. I didn't see anything. There. Did you? Did you see it, Michelle? Yeah, I didn't see it. I didn't see it. I was pretty much I looking you're that direction. direction. I saw right? literally two, two glowing eyes. Two glowing two eyes. Two tall glowing eyes. It was literally up here. Oh, shit. 
Um, you guys are tired. Just I don't look know. around. Yeah, yeah, right. It's late. Like I, my, the camera's really? always looking. The the freaking gunshots, the yelling. Like there's something outside. Freaking warning of the yeah, police. Well, why the is it here? The doors are locked. It doesn't matter. Even if there is something out there, we can just. I say we just cut the cut seance. It. I think we should make sure we lock up, and we just take everything and we just go to sleep. It's been a really crazy night. We can continue like investigating tomorrow or something. We just need to. What time is it? How about we wake up at three, like we normally do? Wake up at three, devil's hour, try to get a seance. Maybe this house is only active during that time. And and we're just here trying to investigate something that just doesn't happen. Okay. Let's, let's we definitely should get some rest though. Okay, guys, we're gonna go to our rooms. We're gonna try to sleep off some of the sightings that we've been seeing. I don't know if we're visualizing things, if we're putting things in our head because we're tired, but it's been a long day. We're gonna try to wake up at three and hopefully the next seance will be the one where we actually get some answers. I'll see you guys then. Basement. We need, to, I need to go get a but no. Whoa. No, we can't leave, what? bro. We can't, we can't leave. leave. We lock the doors and we stay here. We stay here with that yeah. thing downstairs. We need to get the hell out of the house. Wait, wait, wait. No, no it's wait. probably probably a good idea. They, they stay here. We get Shara. If, if everyone goes downstairs, we're just bound to make more noise, right? We get Shara back up here and we just figure something out afterwards. You guys come back here? Yeah. Okay, okay just keep the, keep the doors locked, okay? Okay.
thing that cops are talking about, it's in here. Right yeah. now. Go back upstairs. We need to get everybody. We need to get the hell out of here, okay? Wait, what? The thing? What yeah, the thing? thing is inside the house. Let's go get it. Police the shit. sirens, the gunshots, the yelling. Then shouldn't we be calling the police? We need to make sure we're safe yeah, before we do get anything. Out of your room. <sighs> Worry about that. Why do you think we locked the door? That thing. It's here. It's here. You, you guys are set though. Yeah, okay? we saw. We saw. We it. saw it. It's it's on the main floor somewhere, or in the basement. It's it's in the house. It's f massive. And I don't know what the hell it is. Like I've never seen anything like it. It's uh it's not something we want to be messing with. But we need to get the um, hell out of here somehow. How did you guys get up here? We're, we're gonna get off the balcony like you guys did. Right. It's all the way at the other end of the hall. No. This thing is upstairs. Where are we going to be coming in? We need a way, we need like someone to distract it or something. Cause all Hell of us, no. We're not gonna be we're not distracted for that come. thing. If it's as big as you're saying, no thank you. Yeah, yeah that we might need be a different a... way. Um, well, we need some kind of distraction. Maybe not one of us, like something, like throw something or uh, uh, an alarm, maybe? My phone someone... is broken. My phone is literally broken. I will sacrifice this guy. And we can, I'll put the timer on here. And then we can use that as a distraction. But how? Okay. We'll, mm. we'll try to. I can set it. On like a two minute timer. We'll try to go in the other room. Hopefully yeah. it's loud enough to like bring its attention. I'll put it on full blast. Okay, we got a full blast. Yeah. Two minutes. Is that what we're doing? We're yeah, gonna go do that. Yeah. And once it comes into this room, we need to go to the front door, get in the Jeep, and get the hell out of here. Timer? Yeah, two minute timer. Go. Okay, just put it right there. Goat 
the Goldman Forest yeah. thing. I kept getting flashbacks of that. Like, I kind of like a human, really, really tall. I don't know if there's any like relation, but I was like. Shh. So that's it. We survived the haunted Willow Mansion. But the mansion wasn't really haunted, was it? What was that thing outside? What was that thing that broke into our house and scared the living hell out of all of us? Something tells me that Mr. Willow knew about this all along. And that the house wasn't actually haunted by a ghost but by a monster. Why didn't he tell me about any of this when he sent that message? But one thing's for sure, I'm gonna get to the bottom of this. And I'm gonna take all of you on that journey. If you have any theories, make sure to leave them in the comment section below. And make sure to subscribe because you're not gonna wanna miss out on what's about to come. But until then, thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Hello? Is somebody there? Hello? There's like a few. Oh my god. I don't like this. I don't like this. I'm going in the car. Yeah, let's let's go into the car right now, okay? Okay, let's go, let's go.